It's a classroom setting you won't likely find anywhere else. A Catholic priest and an Anglican priest teaching the same course side by side. The ecumenical department at the Angelicum University in Rome is behind this unique curriculum, geared at teaching students about ecumenism. The course goes beyond denominational lines, giving students two contemporary perspectives on issues that have historically divided Catholics and Anglicans. I hope that the students, when they see us um, discussing, at times disagreeing or taking different emphases, illustrating different approaches to the same questions, uh, that the students themselves uh, recognize or learn something about the way in which um, the dialogue for ecumenism and the and relationships between different traditions within the church uh, can be handled. Even in a class today, I was giving the Anglican view of the Reformation, and then after the break, Rod said, Monsignor Strange, I've got to give the Roman Catholic view. And that made it, the class even better, because the, the students could see that we both had a different understanding of uh, a similar set of events, and yet we were friends in having that. But perhaps the most interesting part about the class is the rapport between the two professors, modeled after one of the most famous friendships in the church's history. The one between Cardinals John Henry Newman and John Pusey, a Catholic and an Anglican, both leaders of the Oxford movement, who remained friends even after Newman left the Anglican church to become a Roman Catholic. We've become friends, which is in itself a kind of reflection if you like, <laughs> in a minor key of what was taking place between, between Newman and Pusey. Ultimately, seeing how two church figures in the 19th century and two church figures in the 21st century can have a deep friendship, even at a moment that our churches don't entirely agree on every subject. So it's the theme of friendship that I want to share with people. So what's Father Bill and Father Roderick's most important lesson? Teaching the students to forge friendships the same way they both did in the spirit of John Henry Newman and John Pusey, all the while learning about ecumenism.